Hey, what? What? Hey. Yeah. You gotta make the Gear Fifth Part Two animation. You already made the first one. I'm doing it. You gotta keep I'm going. I'm doing it right now. Oh, you already you already started. Yeah. Oh, I'm just. Okay. One of the first things we're gonna need to do is create our 3D model. I am obviously an expert. Perfection. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't create the model, but like maybe one day, probably the next edit, wink, 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 stay to the end. Maybe. I'm away from my coffee. Why are you still here? Make sure that these actually look half decent. I, I tend to do a lot of skin fixes, cloth simulation, things like that. One of the only other things that I had to do was create Luffy's hair. Luffy's hair is kind of easy, kind of hard. I ended up settling with some like smoky hair using geo nodes and volumes as the base. So yeah, now I'm gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna go take a shit. So. Dab. I have my models. I fixed them. We need to make sure that they can move now. I kind of want to take a quick break, so I'm actually going to ask a good friend of mine, Xsense, to rig these characters. So obviously, I'll just ask him to do it, you know, because. So next, I have to create the environment. And I know it's so hard. It's so easy i use this simple thing called geometry nodes which you're going to hear that word a lot because it's what i use it's basically it's the houdini of blender and i really shouldn't be giving it that much credit because all i did was scatter a bunch of rocks that i had downloaded and was yeah we can move on we gotta have a problem though i i don't know what i'm making like how long is a piece what am i fighting i don't know i, I decided to just download some clips from the anime cutting up sections that i like to create a nice four minute story i i kind of cut it down to like two minutes so now we basically know what we're making which is solid I, I feel like we're missing just one crucial element we need a sick fucking beat that goes hard as shit i asked my good friend musicality to create a song for me because he recently made a song for the drums of liberation of gear fifth and i'm not gonna lie shit kind of slaps you probably know some songs that he's made like this i made the limitless man reach limits told you you know i'm a savage like this I mean, like, he, he's the go. He produces some good beats. New links will be in the description for all of his stuff. I gotta kind of move on because I'm kind of cold. I don't know if you can see my breath. <laughs> it's so bad. At the beginning of every One Piece episode, there's the narrator that speaks to everybody about the previous episode. I kind of wanted to do that, but I can't afford to hire the actual One Piece narrator. <laughs> the best option is to have AI in this. So I'm going to hire my good friend, Curtis, who has little to no experience speaking Japanese, but he said he'd do it. So let's just take it over to Curtis. Who are you talking to? Take, take one, part two, or take two. Take... Scene one, take two. Sunzo, Sunzo, JRB Wap. That's like a good start right now, but I have to figure out like. Zenkai no One Piece de JRB wa Pato. Wapato, Wapato one, no video. I'm gonna do like the first part. This is also Google Translate. I'm just gonna put these into chunks. I'm so sorry, Josh. You're gonna have to. And I think that's it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna splice it up. If I'm back, that means it was. Sh Thank you guys. Good luck, Josh. <laughs> All the pre-production stuff is settled. I, I still have to do the, the, the animation. Uh, so I'm gonna have to go scene by scene and animate all of these shots. But I have a solution to maybe make my life a little bit easier. There's this magical piece of tech out there called a performance capture suit or a mocap suit for those of you familiar. And what it does is it allows me to put it on and make the characters move while I move. And I'm just saying it's pretty nuts. But obviously I have to animate both Luffy and Kaido and it sadly can't, I can't really stretch my body like Luffy. Kind of wish I could because you know canonically like Luffy could technically stretch other parts of his body that would be really cool. Because Luffy has to be all stretchy and wiggly and do all these things that I can't do it physically I'm gonna have to hand animate them which leaves Kaido. Most of Kaido's remote kept to me some time but you know it definitely didn't take me like five months to do all of Luffy's animation. It's not like I still have to do effects. Oh yeah, speaking of, I wanted to escalate this to like a higher degree than what I normally do. I decided to try Houdini. I don't know how to use it. I barely even know how to open the program. So I'm gonna ask a new friend of mine, Esther, who you, you may or may not know, but he's one of the guys that is responsible for JLX's videos in the past. Probably seen this, this, this is him, by the way. 
This is what he looks like. He's a really chill dude, and he said he would actually help me. So, uh, we're gonna go on call later and, uh, and see. One week later. Okay. I, I, he, he, he texted me, and, and, and it's done. I had to, I had to, like, fucking put, I had to make the Alembic animation of, like, what I need, like, the resolution and scale and, 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 like, and, like, velocity and, maps and, like, and the volume, you know, like, making, and I was, like, fine, I get to use it. So I made it as, like, the ground thing, so, like, the style, like, and then I had to, I had to add all that together, and then, yeah. I did a lot more effects, but most of them were Emergen, and Emergen's really easy. I'm out of breath. Now, everything progressed nicely, but for some reason there were so many sessions I started hating. I couldn't really put my finger on why, and at this point a lot of what I was doing was starting to feel meaningless, especially seeing other great editors and animators make fantastic work. It all kept coming back to asking myself, why? What am I missing? Then I, I started to think about Luffy. The need to be free, to have a crew of friends, to set out on a journey. And in that very moment, I took a chance. I, I booked a flight for my brother and I to go to Hawaii in order to have an adventure and experience more. Now, let me tell you, the experience was worth it. Even outside of having an amazing journey, which was definitely had, but better than that, I felt like I found my crew. See, going here wasn't just for me to relax. It, it was actually to see a group of people that I've been friends with for a while, one of which you guys saw at the beginning of this video. These guys, although producing different content for me, felt refreshing to be around. Finally understanding that there are more people out there that have the same issues as me and can actually understand the problems I face as well. I don't know, but everything for me clicked then. It gave me a moment of clarity. I could go on about this trip, but coming back I felt better and started editing with more confidence. I realized I actually had people by my side who would help me, which if I'm being honest I haven't had until recently with guys like them as well as people like Xsense, Kari, Chester, Zembone, and Bryce, just to name a few. And who better could I have watched my video first than them? Oh my god I get to see this before the world. Well, let me know. I have it open. Do you want me to uh, yeah. <laughs> I was too excited. I had that anime moment of like, oh my god, Curtis, like, oh. <laughs> Curtis is gonna watch my video? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready, I'm ready. Don't judge okay. me too harshly. <laughs> there was something special about sharing this video with these guys. Seeing the joy, the laughter, as well as the hype I could give them, this was the reason I started doing this. This was the meaning behind it all. I know Luffy's dream is to be the Pirate King, but I think I found my dream. And I know Luffy would agree. With that being said, enjoy the final result. Zantai no One Piece de JRB wa pato ichi no video o tsukuta.
thanks so much for watching guys bye